Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. So in this channel, we have talked quite a bit about skincare, self-care, or just grooming, anything to do essentially with your confidence and your physical look and how, how it can just like help you to feel your best, right? And I think one of the things that we kind of like didn't cover so much, I feel like we have mentioned it a couple of times, is sweating. So I think a lot of us, you know, everyone at one point, uh, you know, face was uh, sweating. Uh, some of us actually uh, struggle with excessive sweating, uh, which is something that like, you know, it's in medical terms, it's called hyperhidrosis. Uh, so, you know, every one of us have, uh, I feel like at one point have our fair share, you know, like we, we gotta admit. Uh, sometimes I feel like we don't want to admit it, but you know, something that uh, has happened to many of us. And today, actually, that's why I'm actually partnering with Dre Dry to talk about their three-step solution. And before that, I want us to analyze a little bit about this excessive sweating and mainly the hyperhidrosis and what is it causing it and how you can, you know, take control of it. Couple things that I would say from my experience is that like because I am not necessarily suffering from excessive sweating, uh, but I know that like because hyperhidrosis has is like two kind essentially. One of them is like the primary, which is like based on your like nerves because your nerves is controlling that. So uh, sometimes if you even if you are not like doing something active or just your body temperature is not necessarily rising but you're still sweating so again that's to do with your nerves the second one might be just maybe you have some uh, medical condition that you are not aware of you know there are a lot of uh, like the medical conditions that you don't know like when it comes to diabetes like some of it like some side effects that to do with excessive sweating so uh, you might want to you know check on that so those are like two things like main ones but I know from my experience I had the, like the nerves like the first one uh, it's because <laughs> so many occasions actually has happened to me that like I have used like uh, the cologne I have used like a um, you know the conventional uh, deodorant and hoping that that would just you know cover me and this generally happens like during events for me like whenever I would be like having having a speech like in front of so many people right and or the times that like I'm just like I just have sometimes social anxiety not all the time but there are times I have had that so again this comes from me being nervous and I would know that like afterwards I would like get off the stage or I would just you know be by myself or went to the bathroom and I would just like uh, lift my arms and be like all you know wet so super embarrassing and that has happened to me so many times is that like I feel sometimes uncomfortable with certain things that I'm wearing not because like I feel like I know that like I'm looking bad it's just more that like I feel like I know that like this is not something I generally wear so hence I feel uncomfortable and I feel like everyone's judging me again social anxiety so that causes that not pretty and there are occasions that I also know and people have told me this and it just never works they they will say like oh you can like use too much cologne right that 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 will kind of cover the smell yes it can potentially cover the smell but first this is still gonna show up you know whether it, like if you're using it or not unless the, if your day around is not working it's gonna show up anyways but other thing is like when you are sweating especially excessive sweating uh, your cologne, perfume, whatever you're using, it's gonna be mixed in. It is such a weird way of saying it, but like it does get mixed in, and I have like smelled myself so many like couple times that it has happened to me that like it was just combination. It wasn't just the cologne, and that's when you know that like you have that sweating, but also cologne together. So it doesn't really you know solve the problem. It's like kind of like putting a bandage on the problem. So anyways, today, that's why we're going to be talking about Dre Dry uh, three-step solution. So they have uh, these three products in this solution. That first one starts with their PM antiperspirant. So this PM one, it's like a little clear gel that you're applying under your arms uh, at night. Uh, you should definitely do it like when your arm, underarms are dry. There's one basic thing that I would recommend to anyone is that like whenever you're applying any sort of antiperspirant or deodorant in your arm, underarms, make sure that your underarms are dry 
sometimes I feel like when we shower, right, right after shower, like they're going out, we just put the, you know, deodorant right after, then our underarms are like not even dry, then like if you're applying it, it's not gonna, it's gonna keep wet longer, hence it's gonna be like pointless at that point. So make sure that it's dry at this or dry it with a towel so that like it's dry. So anyways, definitely make sure you apply a little bit of this at night. Uh, so you're gonna use this for a couple of weeks so you can see the results. Then afterwards, the next day, you can actually wash it. Uh, you can wash it with the dry dry deep cleansing wash. So this wash really is gonna help you to just like um, keep your uh, underarm clean, but also like just clean that gel that was sitting in your underarm for overnight. Uh, you can, they actually send me this like really cute uh, towel that was the dry dry logo, which is so cute um, that you know, you can try any sort of towel, but I just want to show you guys because it's cute. Uh, so you can use this one, then wash it off, right? Then you're going off with your day, you're just using this AM uh, deodorant and antiperspirant. So this one is like shaped in like a regular conventional deodorant that you can use. Um, just take it out, slide it off, put it on, then you go on with your day. So it's essentially the entire routine. Super simple that you can use for a couple of weeks and see how it works out for you. They even have the body spray that you can use. I just use so many body sprays. So this is one of the good ones that I really like actually because most body sprays have their own scent. So this one actually is unscented. So you can use it while you can also apply your own cologne perfume that you want to use because, you know, let's be honest, body sprays might work for that reason, like for not sweating, but like most of their smells is not that great. So you want to use your own cologne and perfume so you can, you know, combine it. So I think I really like that part, it's unscented. So I'll put the links down below so you guys can check it out and let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you guys next week with another video. Bye guys.